go. Hi, welcome to Extro Sports. I want to give you a quick rundown of some of our summer wetsuits and give you hopefully a clearer idea on what's the right suit for you and which one's going to be best for your sport. Most of our summer wetsuits will be a 3mm thickness, uh, unlike a winter wetsuit that will be 5 From there you have the choices of how warm you want to stay and that also depends on what time of the year that you want to get in the water. First of all, we'll start at the top. Here is a standard 3mm through the body, two in the shoulders and arms and we have a liquid taping on the outside which will give your suit a more reliable seam and the seam on the inside is glued and stitched which keeps the water out. If you feel that you want to be in the water from Easter to October or maybe a little bit later this is an excellent suit to consider. In the back of these suits we also have a barrier. This barrier is going to keep you dry, stop the water passing through the zip and in turn keep you warmer. You can expect to pay about £149 for a suit like this. Still keeping with a glued and stitched wetsuit, we have one here which is using a normal blind stitch seam, but we don't have the liquid taping. You have an easier entry with no barrier. But again, in terms of a season, you'll be happily able to use this from probably May to about September, and you can expect to pay around £115 for one of these. Still within the full suit, 3mm again, but we now have a different stitching. This is called flat lock, which is a seam that leaks water. Now that's fine when our waters are warm, which is really for most of the time in this country, June, July, August, and maybe a bit of September. Uh, prices for a suit like this, with a normal back entry, can be expected to be around £89. A very popular choice for the height of the season is a shorty. Still with a flat lock seam, short arms, short legs, great for July and August um, if you're getting too warm.